Hi everyone, welcome to Study Simplified Community. Today our topic is Fourier Series Basics. So make sure you are watching the lesson completely to get the concept and related gate question. So the very first point is about the definition of Fourier Series. Any periodic signal can be represented by a set of complex exponential signal provided that it satisfies the Dirichlet condition. So basically you can apply the Fourier Series only to the periodic signal, the point number one. And you can represent this periodic signal in the form of a set of complex exponential signal. Basically, we have two types. Either you can go for the complex exponential signal or you can represent it in the terms of sine and cos. So this form is known as the trigonometric form of the Fourier series and this form is known as the exponential form of the Fourier series. But to convert the periodic signal to all this form, the signal should satisfy the Dirichlet condition. Now le let us see what are the Dirichlet conditions. In total we have four condition. The first condition is signal should be a periodic signal. The second point is if you integrate this periodic signal over a given time period, the answer should be a finite value. Okay, so it should be less than infinity. If it is equal to infinity, then you cannot apply the Fourier series concept. The third point. There are finite number of maxima and minima in the given interval and the fourth point is finite number of discontinuities in the given interval. If all the four conditions are satisfied then only you can apply the Fourier series and then only you can do the expansion. So please make a note for the gate examination. The very first point is if your signal is periodic then you can apply the Fourier series concept but if your signal is non-periodic or if it is aperiodic then you cannot apply the Fourier series concept. In that case, you can go for the Fourier transform. Okay, so Fourier transform is applicable for both the signal, non-periodic and periodic signal. Very important point. Okay, there is one gate question on this concept as well. If your given signal is a periodic, then you cannot apply the Fourier series concept. This is one gate question we will see soon. Now, there is one more important point in the Fourier representation. The signals are the function of frequency. So this is very important because this will help you to plot the signal. So let us see the first gate question, Telecom 2002 one mark gate question, which of the following cannot be the Fourier series expansion of the periodic signals. So first point is they are asking which one of the following cannot be the Fourier series expansion. Fourier series expansion is only possible for the periodic signal, but if your signal is a periodic signal, then you cannot apply the Fourier series. Your task is to check which of the following is a periodic signal. If uh, you got the aperiodic signal then that would be the correct option because that option uh, cannot uh, undergo the Fourier series concept. So if you want to check whether a given signal is periodic or aperiodic signal you should know your concept. The concept was if the time ratio is rational then the signal is periodic. If it is not rational, if it is irrational, then the signal is not periodic. And you have to check which signal is not periodic because if the signal is not periodic, then you cannot apply the Fourier series expansion and that would be the correct option. So let us check one by one with the help of option A. I can say that omega 1 value is 1 and omega 2 value is 3. So T1 over T2 is omega 2 over omega 1 which is 3. And yes, this ratio is rational and hence it is periodic and we can apply the Fourier series concept. You might be thinking why this ratio because you have studied the formula T is equal to 2 pi over omega. Using this formula, I can say that T1 over T2 is omega 2 over omega 1. Apply for the rest option and you will get your answer. So in this option, you can see that the ratio would be 7 upon pi and this ratio is irrational and yes if it is irrational then you cannot apply the Fourier series because it is a periodic signal. So basically you have to check which ratio is irrational. In option C the ratio uh, this is the DC component this is always periodic and here omega value is 1. So the uh, point here is cos t is uh, periodic so this uh, option x of t is equal to cos t plus 0 0.5 this is a periodic signal and hence Fourier series can be applied this is not the correct option. So option D also if you see carefully 1.5 pi and 3.5 pi if you take the ratio 3.5 pi upon 1.5 pi the ratio is rational which is 35 over 15 the ratio is rational and hence the signal is periodic so this is also not the correct answer.
लेट एस सी वन मोर गेट क्वेश्चन चूज द फंक्शन एफ ऑफ टी वेर टी इज ग्रेटर देन माइनस इन्फिनिटी लेस देन इन्फिनिटी फॉर विच अ फूरियर सीरीज कैन नॉट बी डिफाइंड फूरियर सीरीज कैन नॉट बी डिफाइंड और फूरियर सीरीज इज नॉट एप्लीकेबल फॉर ओनली दो सिग्नल विच इज नॉट पीरियोडिक और अपीरियोडिक सो लेट एस चेक अमंग दिस फोर ऑप्शन विच इज अपीरियोडिक सो ऑप्शन डी इज पीरियोडिक दिस इज अ डी सी कंपोनेंट डी सी कंपोनेंट इज ऑलवेज पीरियोडिक मेक अ नोट okay so this is periodic and sin t yes this is also periodic no problem then about this part you have to take the ratio which is t1 over t2 is omega 2 over omega 1 so omega 2 value is 7 10 omega 1 value is 20 and yes this ratio is a rational ratio so this is also uh, periodic and this uh, here in this case also we can apply the fourier series so option a is wrong option b is wrong option d is wrong so the correct answer is option c and this is not periodic and hence we cannot apply the fourier series expansion so please make a note whenever you have exponential function that signal is non periodic either it can be e raised to t or e raised to minus t or it can be e raised to mod t in all this cases we have exponential term remember that e raised to jt is different okay e raised to jt is complex exponential which is a periodic signal and the period is 2 pi but the normal exponential signal this are not periodic and hence we cannot apply the fourier series concept तो फ्रेंड्स अगर आपको मेरी वीडियो पसंद आ रही हो देन टू लाइक दिस वीडियो शेयर विथ योर फ्रेंड्स एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल तो मिलते हैं अगली वीडियो में टिल देन टेक केयर दिस इज ट्रेनिंग जैन पीस आउट